So, I'm like pregnant. Mental. Yes, but you do have options. Have you thought about your future? Yeah, I'm going to be a pop star. No, the baby's future. Oh my God, I can take the baby on X Factor. It'll be like my backstory or something. What I mean is, a lot of young girls in your situation sometimes feel they're not ready for this kind of responsibility. Mum can make us matching outfits. I really think you should consider this carefully. And we can even both wear tiaras. Having children is not a game. I can even enter the baby into that shopping centre competition. They do all their makeup and everything. Miss Kelty, take these leaflets, go home, read them. Then you and your partner can discuss all your options. Mate, I've totally forgot to tell Davo. Miss Kelty, your leaflets. Oh man, I totally forgot. I still need that prescription for the pill. I hate to love you. I don't even know why I started. No. I know why. I don't really regret it, but I'm not sure that I shouldn't. You make me sick. You're not even here and you make me sick, but I still love you. I need you. You realise you've completely ruined my life because you were my life and now you're gone. Now what am I supposed to do? I hate you, you know that. I hate you because... Because I am so in love with you. I am not jealous. Why would I be jealous of you? You've got no money, no boyfriend. I don't want a boyfriend. You're just jealous because I'm having sex and you're not. I'm a sexual person, Anna, and men pick up on that. I think it's the pheromones. It's because you don't wear any clothes. What are you wearing now? Your pants. Pajama shorts. Oh, well, just cover yourself up. You're such a prude. I am not. Why do you think everyone at school called you Mrs Frosty? Because you told everyone I was frigid. <laughs>